you know, ever since the, the, uh, the end of the outbreak, uh, Singapore has joined many countries to put in place all that is necessary to carry out active surveillance of uh, possible cases of SARS, to increase our isolation facilities, and to be prepared for any uh, resurgence of SARS. Yeah. And uh, we, we are the, the concerned about the resurgence of SARS. That is possible. And uh, so that's why the, the, we ask the, the member countries to maintain their surveillance. And uh, we still don't know the ecology of the, the SARS virus. We don't know the where the, the viruses are now. The possibly or the more likely to be uh, the animals in uh, somewhere in southern China. But uh, we don't know the which animal. And, and uh, we don't know if this virus has any seasonality. So in that sense, we need to, to keep our surveillance system. Then we're not describing it as a positive case. We're saying he, he, he reacted positively to the test. This is not a SARS positive case. This is a suspected case. And don't forget, we had suspected cases in Hong Kong and Canada. Uh, we're keeping our fingers crossed that this is basically just one more of those. The precursor to the warning. A precursor? I'm not saying there's no big danger, <laughs> but we're not treating it as a probable SARS case. Mm -hmm.